Evelyn. This is going to be my first ever YouTube video and today I thought I would do something really simple. As you can tell by the title, it's just going to be a clothing haul of all the clothes that I've been gathering ever since quarantine started because I'm a online shopping addict and it became even worse when I had no choice but to shop online and not go to the actual mall. So um, this is it. And um, I am broke now because of it, but I couldn't be happier with my clothes. So I hope you enjoy and let's just get started. So for the first thing, I'm, I'm already wearing it because I couldn't help myself. Um, this shirt is actually from Shein and I actually bought from Shein and Romwe, but this was like the only thing that I got from there and like another thing um for some reason i like buying from wrongly as well but the first thing yes it was a shirt i lost track of it also i do this a lot so if you hate hand gestures while talking i'm sorry i've tried to stop but it's not gonna stop so yes this shirt it's like blue and um everybody's been getting it on like tiktok and stuff and i really wanted it so that's why i got it and it's like really like t-shirt material um gonna get an up close shot um it's very like tiny and like cropped if you don't wear high-waisted jeans like i am right now and it has like ruffled detailing right here and it's really really comfortable like you can really like do a lot with this shirt like it's not um you know like those like cute shirts but that like feel like whoa like it's really comfortable and stuff i really like it and the next thing that i have are these levi's jeans um that i'm really excited about because they're mom jeans and they were on sale and that is why i got them or else i wouldn't buy levi's jeans but um yes they're having like a huge warehouse sale right now so whatever jean style you like you might find something that you like um because I did and like sometimes it's like a hit or miss because like in the morning like they could have the, the jean style that you like and then they'll go out of stock and then the next day for some reason they'll have it on stock again so it's just that kind of thing where you have to keep checking I have another one coming in and I'm so excited but anyways and now that we're on the Levi's subject I actually got another thing from there um, I got this really cute winter jacket that I'm so excited about it's like your basic Levi's um sherpa jacket which i'm so excited about because i have a lot of these but they've never been levi's and i love everything about this jacket and usually these are a hundred dollars and i only paid 24 dollars for this so i'm so happy about it um so yes maybe it's still on the website maybe it's not okay so next is like things that i got from romley so the first things that i got were these bandanas because i'm really into bandanas right now as is everybody i don't even know if i said that right but everybody's into bandanas right now and i i have a bandana from um h m and i really loved it but it was like 12 16 dollars i believe and these are literally only three dollars and i was so excited about it except that it's a little too big like you put it around your head gonna pretend like i'm doing it way too like the triangle is too big i don't know if i like maybe it's just me or like you can actually do it like the triangle around your head type of situation but i still really love them because they're really cheap and i just love the pattern i feel like this black and white bandana could go with so many things that way i don't have to buy a bandana for every single outfit and um this weekend i actually did the whole like like headband bandana thing and i loved it so much and you can also do like the ponytail situation you could do so many things with bandanas and i just love that it's a trend now because it was like a trend when i was in middle school and i love when things that i used to wear come back because it just makes it more fun for me to go down memory lane and stuff and the next one that i got after that this one is pink and green with flowers on it and i absolutely love these colors together i think it just looks really pretty um and yeah so i'm gonna get like an up close shot and i still think that they're really good for the price that you're getting um okay so the next thing that i got from romley was actually this green skirt it's really pretty it has ruffles at the bottom and like a bow at the top and i just think it's like so girly and flirty and stuff and i just really love it um and it has that like stretch elastic which 
I'm obsessed with because I definitely gained a few pounds during quarantine and so we need that extra. That's right there, like, we need it. But anyways, yes. So the next thing that I got after that is very similar to the skirt actually and I hate myself for it. But this is a, actually a dress and it's a little bit of a on the darker side than the other one and it has daisies on it. And the thing that I also love about it is that it has ties. So like you tie it like that and it just has like the drawstrings like coming out, I guess you could say. Um, it has daisies on it and I just love like the shape of it. I think is really flattering, um, which is what, you know, like made me want to buy it. Um, and I just like really imagine myself like wearing like a jean jacket with it and like some white sneakers for like a day night or something. Like I love wearing that type of stuff and that's why I got this. So after that, this is my favorite thing that I got from Shein actually. Um, and this shirt, I was looking for it everywhere. <laughs> So I finally found it and I'm so excited about it. Um, through the help of a YouTuber, I found it and this is a shirt. I'm so excited. It has bow, it has ties at the top and a butterfly patch and it is super soft. It is like that pillow, like it's just beautiful. Um, it's very soft. That was an amber alert. Anyways, um, so it has this beautiful patch on it. It's super soft, like a freaking blanket, but better than a blanket. Like I can't explain it. It's so comfortable to wear. I love it so much. And it took me a long time to find this. So I really love this shirt and that's all I have to say about it. I'm gonna stop talking about it. <laughs> okay. um, the next store I'm gonna do is Airy. And in Airy, I got these really cute um, jean shorts. Also, most of this clothes is gonna be wrinkled because I've just had it in my drawers. It's all wrinkled and I'm sorry for the presentation, but we have to keep going, so yes. So these are like jean, not jean, like that jean colored, um, really basic um, shorts with a tie on the front. And I just really love them because it's like that flowy style. Um, you could really dress these up or you could dress them down. Most of this clothes I actually bought thinking of a trip that I was gonna go to this summer in Cancun, Mexico, but then, you know, quarantine happened and my parents' passports would never come in. And so we just decided not to go. Like nobody really like stopped us from going, but you know, we decided not to go because you know, we don't wanna get infected. We don't wanna get other people infected. It's just not the time right now to have a vacation. And so I ended up buying all this clothes and now I have to save it until next summer when we go and um makes me sad because i love all of this clothes but i also can't use it because then i'll have to buy clothes later on again and it's just not a good idea so this is one of the things that i had gotten for that and the next thing that i got from airy i love them so much these shorts are so cute um they have like flowers on them like you can barely tell but I love the material and the stretchiness and these aren't for like your everyday wear these just go on top of a swimsuit and I love that because you know when I wear a swimsuit I don't want to be like showing my booty and stuff so I like to cover up at least in my bottom and these are perfect for that so I had gotten that for that trip the next store that I bought clothes from was Gap and you might be thinking why would you shop at Gap but my mom makes me go. She thinks that I should get clothes from there. But some of it was not too bad. This was a light blue tank top that I love because I'm really into like tank tops right now. And I cropped them and stuff. And I had never seen one that was this color. So I was really excited about it. And these are only like $3. So I'm just going to crop it. And I think it's going to look really good with just an everyday look. And the next thing that I got is actually similar to the other thing that I got before. I also got it to put on top of my swimsuit. They're just white basic shorts and I decided to get them at Gap because they were only $10 and I was fairly certain that anywhere else they would have been more than that. So that's why I got them there. And the next thing that I got were these really cute sleeping shorts 
because I was gonna go on a trip and I didn't really have pajamas. So I got these sleeping shorts and they're really cute. They remind me of like Victoria's Secret, but just like not as expensive. Um, and like the pink isn't too like bright, you know? It's just like really light peachy color and I really love them and I'm so excited to wear them next year. So yeah. The next store that I shopped online was Aeropostale, which you also might be thinking, why would you buy from Aeropostale? But they were having a sale and I thought, why not? Cheap clothes maybe there's something good and there was and my mom actually offered to buy me this shirt and it's tie-dye and i love it so much i've been so much into tie-dye that's all i'm gonna say i love tie-dye that's all i've been doing during quarantine is tie-dyeing shirts and usually i wouldn't buy a tie-dye shirt because you can do it yourself because these are like 20 dollars, but she actually got it on sale for six dollars and I just love her so much for it because my mom doesn't really buy me things anymore now that, you know, I'm like an adult or whatever. So I really love this one because it's like purple and yellow and it's pastels and I just really love it and I'm so excited to wear it. And the next thing that I got, I just kept looking at it and I was like, should I get it or should I not get it? And I did end up getting it for one reason only and that is because I had a vision and I was like, I'm going to take this Instagram picture and it's going to be so good and like... I'm going to be like walking in the sand and there's going to be like sand on my toes and I'm going to be wearing a sun hat and it's just going to be like a vibe, you know? And then I didn't go, but I'm still excited about the dress. It is yellow and it has like so many different patterns on it and I just love it. It's super long like maxi dress and it's just like this. And I feel like if it's not your style and it's not your style, I didn't know if it was mine, but then I wore it and I thought about the picture and I was like, Yes, this was the right decision for me. And you might be thinking, that's an ugly dress. Like, who wears mustard yellow? I do. I believe in the strength of my imagination for this picture. Next thing that I have is from Abercrombie. And I actually bought this when quarantine, like COVID, like didn't really hit yet and the malls were still open. Um, but I decided to put it on here because it was very near that that time and this is just a black skirt and I really really love it it's like has yellow on it and my light is way too bright um and black like yellow little flowers and it's just like I don't know what these skirts are called like I used to know the name of it and then suddenly I bought a bunch of them and I forgot the name of it so I just really love it it also has that stretch which I love as I have said before and the last store that I have things from, well, I'm also going to show something after, but that's besides the point, um, is Forever 21, which if you go on the app, you can find some really cute stuff, not just like the really weird like sayings that they have on the sweaters, which is just totally weird. But the first thing that I got from there, I love so much. It's just like the... I lost my train of thought. It's just like the black skirt. This is a blue. This reminds me of like Cinderella blue, which I love that color so much because I feel like it's so classy and like original. Like, you know, it's just that classic original blue color. You know, like it just reminds you of your childhood, at least for me it does. And I just love it because the flowers in it are like iridescent, holographic. I don't know what you would call this, but that's definitely what it is. And the next thing that I got is this peach shirt with flowers on it. Everything that I buy is going to have some type of flower on it. And if it doesn't, it's going to have a butterfly on it or it's going to be a pastel color. Like, I don't like that's just my three go to's butterflies, flowers, pastels. It's the only way that I dress. I'm being so annoying. Anyways, so. This is like a peach shirt and it has like ruffled, like, like really puffy sleeves that I love and they're white and it's just like really nice as you can see and it has little ties where the puffy sleeves are at and, and the next shirt, um, I was really excited about when I ordered it and then I got it and I was like, this is kind of underwhelming cause I ordered a medium accidentally cause I'm going through this really weird phase right now where I'm not a small. But if I order a certain thing in a medium, it won't fit right because I'm just like in between the small and the medium people. Like it just makes no sense. 
so <laughs> um i got this shirt and it was supposed to go with the other things that i had bought in and it just didn't go with that other piece as a bottom so i just don't know what to do with the shirt yet but i still kind of love it um it also has daisies on it and it's like this like weird material i don't know how to describe and it's just really nice and it kind of just speaks for itself and the next thing that i got is also one of my favorite pieces ever and it looks just like all the other skirts that I've bought. Somebody please tell me what these skirts are called because I'm tired of just saying these skirts. But it has white tulips on it. it this one is not stretchy, very sad. Um, and it's longer than the blue one and I just love this color green. Like I think this is such a unique green. Like you don't really see, well now you do, but you know, this green isn't really out there a lot and I just, Love how muted and light it is, so that's why I love that skirt. Next one is also a green skirt. Apparently, I'm obsessed with the color green. This is a, like, um, it has flowers on it also with, like, black. Um, I don't know what the part of the flower this is called, but it has buttons. Oh, my God, I'm completely showing it wrong. It has buttons down the middle. And this reminds me of like a skater skirt, like when those were really in. But when I looked at it on the website, I thought it was like more of a straight cut, which is like more in style right now. But I still think it's really cute. And I'm going to try to find something that goes really well with it because I think it's still worth wearing. And the next thing is a slip dress, which I love so much because I just love like the slip like look texture, like... I just like how it's shiny and stuff and it's just really flattering and it's like really hugs your body in all the right places but not too much and it's pink and it just has a lot of pretty flowers on it again just like always and yeah it's just really nice I really like it it's pretty short has a cute little um slit right there but it's not too showy so I really like it and the last clothing item that I have I just shook the camera <clears throat> are these pants that are just like the shorts that I got from Airy, except they're pant version and they're a little bit darker and I really like these pants and yeah and the next things that I got are all swimsuits because like I said I was gonna be at the beach and I got them from Abercrombie, Cup She, and She Bromley. I actually have some of my sister's swimsuits on here, and I guess I could show them to y'all just so you know, in case you want to show them or whatever. So, the first swimsuits that my sister got are from Forever 21, and I really like this one. I'm, I'm like gonna wear it when she's done wearing it. It's red and it has flowers, and um, it's just like that, like it's like a tank top, but like cropped. And I really love that style, like that type of swimsuit. I'm here for it. And these are the bottoms. And um, I don't know if I'm gonna try on the swimsuits just cause like, you know, that's kind of weird. So I think I'm just gonna do a try on portion of the clothes, but I'll let you know how they work. Um, these are really cute. They're high waisted, covered with that tummy, you know, bloatiness and stuff, really like that. And this one is like a gingham um, yellow one. And I really like this as well. And this she didn't get a bottom for because she's just, she didn't like the bottoms for it. So um, she's gonna get something else. And she liked this bottom, but I don't think it goes with that, but she's gonna add it to something else. <laughs> These are also high-waisted and they have little daisies on them and yeah. And the next swimsuit that I have is from Romwe, and I love this swimsuit so much because, like I said, I've been into tie dye. So yes, I got a tie dye swimsuit. So I'm glad I read it. It is like a dark blue with other like lighter blue, and it's like a sports bra type of um shape, and I really love it. And these are the bottoms right here. I already tried it on. Very nice, not see through. I definitely recommend um swimsuits from there sometimes it's a hit or miss but i like to look at the reviews before i buy anything and actually this one didn't have any reviews and i still trusted it and it came out good so i really like it 
so excited about this one because it's tie dye. And the next one that I got is from Abercrombie, and I love this swimsuit so much because the colors in it, like, I just love it. It reminds me of Easter. It's like lavender, yellow, and green, and I just think, oh my god, that looks so good together. And I love how it has like the wire at the bottom, and <laughs> it has a tie in the back, and I just, I love this swimsuit. I had to show it up close because this is just a type of swimsuit that you're like, yes, look at it. It's beautiful. And the bottoms for that, I didn't want to buy because they were a little too cheeky for me. So I bought white bottoms on Romwe. And they're like not high waisted, but they go like midway. And they're just white and basic. And they're not see through, which I love. So, and the next swimsuits that I have are from Cup She, which I love this website so much. I discovered it like last year and it, they're so like inexpensive like they have their expensive swimsuits which are really nice but they always have a sale section and the sale section is just as good as their normal like regular price swimsuits so the first one that i got from there is this one i don't know why i bought it like at the time i thought it was really cute and now that i look back at it i'm like you could have gotten a cuter one but i think it's still nice but I'm so not sure. It's black and it has, this reminds me of Thanksgiving, honestly. So that's why I think I'm not like, not as flattered by it as the other ones, but it has like this crisscross look to it. Flowers, of course, like just like some greenery and the girl in the picture looked really good in it. And I think that's what made me buy it. But it's just weird because the bottoms are the same pattern. And it has like these little lines on it but the inside it's reversible and it has this pattern but the cup part isn't isn't reversible so like why would you wear this pattern and this pattern just makes no sense to me but you know just went along with it and the next one is probably my favorite swimsuit out of the cup she website i just think it's so cute it is like it really might mean but like mexican vibed type of thing because you know you have like the embroidered um f shirts and dresses and i just i love embroidery and i love mexico and i was like i'm gonna be in mexico might as well get to the swimsuit and i really love it still um and these are the bottoms for it it has embroidered flowers on it and i just love these colors together like that blue just really caught my attention it has little ruffles on the side which i think is like a really cute detail and the top is even more cute i need a so um it has like a tie in the middle and the cup is just like scattered with the flowers and i just think oh my god it's like adorable so i have to get that one and the next one I'm going to try to insert a picture of it because when I take it out, you won't even be able to tell what it is. Like, it's just so weird. Like, I don't understand it myself, but on the website, it looks really cute. And on, it looks really cute. But like I said, I don't really want to try them on. So it's like really weird. <laughs> it's like a, like, yes, this part goes right here. And this is looped around like so. You can kind of tell. But this is the whole swimsuit like that. It's honestly so adorable and I love this color. This is my favorite color of all time. I love pink. I love light green and I love light blue. All my favorite colors. Um, I also have a few shoes that I got. These I got from Abercrombie also for my trip. But I've still been wearing them just because, you know, I don't really like... I. Um, I think they'll still be good for them. They're just like Birkenstock kind of style, but not at all, you know, like the material is definitely different and it's more like beachy and I just really love them. So I've been wearing these like pretty much ever since I got them. And the next thing I've actually got recently because I actually did go um, to the mall um, because, you know, like they opened all the businesses up again and I went to Katie Mills, which is an outlet mall and like nobody was there we had masks on we were hand sanitizing like every 30 seconds so very safe like i really really try not to get close to people it was like really empty so i thought that was really nice which made me feel safe for the most part 
and I got these shoes at Steve Madden and it's actually a Steve Madden outlet store and oh my god it was like very nice so I just got these sandals that are kind of like Tory Burch style but they're much cheaper and I love them so much I'm trying to show the right sides so they're just like strappy um and yeah I love them a lot they're like the same color all my sandals are like brown so yeah and the last thing that I got there was actually this Kate Spade backpack that my dad bought me so I'm really proud of that because um you, like I said before my parents don't really buy me stuff anymore because I make my own money um and I just really love it because I wear a lot of backpacks I'm not really a purse girl I wear a purse when I need to or like if I think it's really cute then I'll buy it but for the most part I always have a backpack on and um i either have like my kankin or like a backpack that i got from forever 21 and i just really wanted a good quality backpack so my dad got me this kate spade backpack and i love it because it's like cute not too big not too small and it's just really perfect for your everyday needs and yeah so that's the last thing that i got um and i haven't bought anything since so far so yeah um and I really hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope I um, enjoyed filming it and I'm gonna have a lot of cool videos coming up. So I hope you watch and subscribe. Bye.